Is it going? Yep. Okay. Don't laugh at my intro and stuff. <laughs> Have you watched any of my videos? No. Are we going to edit this out? Uh, yeah, I will. No. No? no leave it. Okay. Uh, hey, everyone. Alistair here again with another unboxing video. I have done too many of these. I have honestly done too many of these. But this one's a little different. You can see that my uh, background has changed. That's because I'm in a hotel room at a convention. This suit got delivered like an hour before I had to show up at this hotel to check in. Like, wow. Uh, so I got the suit in the mail, we packed up the car and we left. So I don't, I haven't seen any of it. It's like, here's a box. It's a big dude. But wait, there's also this box, which is a bigger dude. I hope I didn't show my label, my address. <laughs> uh, so yeah, uh, this is gonna be a trip, y'all. I hope y'all are ready. Uh, I don't have my green knife to open these boxes. I do have my pocket knife though, so that'll have to do. Um, Knife safety. I don't know if I should start with the big box or the little box. Or the big knife. I don't need the big knife. Uh, should I start with the, with the head or the body? I think the, the head, the, right? The head's kind of like the crown jewel. So should that be first or last? I feel like that should be last. Okay. Also, my partner Taylor is here. They're helping me. They're helping. awesome. I love them. I almost just stabbed you with a knife. Okay. Don't threaten me with a good time. So I'm going to be opening the big boy box. And unfortunately, I not don't have a situation where I can like hold it up for the camera to see it. Do you want me to bring over this extra? Uh, don't call it that. Demonetized. This is a family friendly. Demonetized. Show. You did. You have demonetized me. I can't put ads on this now. <laughs> oh my God. You're an absolute menace. Um, is that thing? Okay, let's see if that'll work. So I have this like table here that I can put this on, but you can't see me and I won't be able to get into it. So I think we'll just put it on the ground. Sex chair's lower. I don't want to use the sex chair. What about the uh, ottoman? For room? anyone who doesn't know, the sex chair is like a chaise lounge that's in the hotel room. It's not a sex chair. Anthro common memories. Oh my god, that's been so long ago. Okay. It has, but that's where it came from. What about this ottoman? What about the ottoman? It's lower. No, I just think I'll just do it on the ground and I'll hold it up. It'll okay. be easier. Okay, y'all. We're getting into this this big boy box. Are you joining me? Maybe. Maybe. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh, it's stuffed. This is a this is a big boy box, y'all. Don't let me forget that I just put my knife on this bed because I will. That's how I live my life. I'll lose it. Oh my god. Okay, what is this? It's a foot. That is a single. That's bigger than Dell's foot. It's a foot, y'all. That's oh that's my than Del's god. Foot. And you're so I haven't told you what the character is. I haven't told you who the maker is. Because I'm kind of trying to keep it a little bit of a surprise, surprise. So, yeah, this is a foot. Like, this foot is like the size of my torso. Like, oh my god, it's so soft. It's so soft. Okay, I'm gonna so set it. Like a size comparison foot? Oh, yeah, if you wanna bring Dell over here with his foot. I mean, does Dell have big feet though? Dell has big stompies. Okay, can you find it? Yes. It's a significant foot. So, comparison, this is my uh, partner's fursuit foot. Uh, size 12 men's. Size 12 men's. And that's a big foot, you know. It's a good little little foot. Um, uh, I can't get them both on camera. <laughs> They're, uh, it's big, y'all. And you're wearing a women's seven? I wear a child seven. Yeah. I wear a child seven shoe. This is huge. Oh my God. Here's Dale's foot. <laughs> um, I'll put this back on the bed here. With your knife? With my knife. You can't, it's not out of something frame. That's okay. I assume this will be the other foot. It is. It is indeed the other foot. Oh my God, it's 
Oh, so my fast. thighs are gonna burn. Okay. Why are your things so small? They're just fun. Okay, these are. I can tell these are the hand paws, and they're like up in this little bag. That's so minuscule. They're so. Oh, oh. To be fair, I have tiny hands, so. You also have tiny feet. Look at the feet. Okay, but like, listen. Don't do that to me. So these are the hands. Look at them. Let me. Let me see if I can. My jacket sleeve is too tight. Ooh, they're very they're very dexterous. Like in the fact that they move, not dexterous in grabbing. I can tell you that right off the bat. It's like I can at least do grabby grab. I can make like grabby hands. Uh, no paw pads, obviously. Just like some little dudes, some little claw dudes. Love that. So have they seen Midas's paws? Uh, I don't know if they've seen Midas's paws. Can you grab better than with Midas? No, Midas's paws are amazing. Where is Midas? I don't know, you had him. He's in your car. Fuck. We left him in the car. Parked close. I was, gonna sh I was gonna compare his paws, but. You want Del's paws? No, I don't. Del's no paws are not great. So the next thing in the box is um, a bodysuit. For those of y'all who know, I don't really wear full suits, but like, why do I have a bodysuit then? He's gonna be great. Um, He's so big. This, like, this bag is huge. Is that in, is that with all the padding in it already? I don't. I, I would assume so. Is it removable padding? I believe it is. <laughs> I don't remember what I asked for. I hope you asked for removable padding. <laughs> I hope I did a lot of things. <laughs> uh, I want to try to just get it open without cutting it. So you can reuse the bag? Yeah, because I feel like that's going to be a good way to transport it so I don't have a tote it for is it. It is absolutely good. I'm going to need a big tote like yours. I mean, like my current tote or my old tote? I don't know. Fuck. Well, you know how, you know how big Devil is with his padding. He's not that, his padding's not that big, though. It's not. Also, the suit has padding. I don't know if you got that from our conversation we're having. And you're completely <laughs> ignoring the, the camera while I struggle no. to open this big old bag. This is absolutely a candid piece. Oh, oh. oh. You didn't point that out. The lining? The ribbed bit. Yeah, the, the hand pulls have it too. Look. In the unboxing, yeah. like those nice little look. details. Look, and it's not sheep for nose. Huh? It's not sheep for nose. I didn't say I thought you did. No. They got nice elastic little like cuffs. No, you're doing an unboxing, not showing off the oh. little details. And sure. there's a tag. Yeah. There's a tag. Uh, this per this suit is made by Tunny says IDK. Uh, I love Tunny. Tunny oh is awesome. They're so snug. I'm trying to have a video. I'm sorry. And you're just like I'm, fisting my foot paws. I'm excited for you. I'm excited for me too. I'll never be able to wear yarn. No, you will not. Um, okay. Okay, this is his tail. Is it, I don't know if it's attached. <laughs> I don't know if it's attached. So if any of y'all know me or follow me on any like social media or art accounts, you may be familiar with this character. Would I've had him, assistance? I've had him for a while. I, oh man, I might, I think, I don't, I don't know what's happening. And you just slurp. Uh, okay. Is his tail attached? It is. It is attached. Okay. That's gonna be good. 100% attached? So y'all may know uh, this character if y'all follow me or see my art or the art that I post. I've had this character for a few years. A very good friend of mine designed this character for me as a custom design. And I didn't tell them that I was getting it as a suit so that I could surprise them because I think they'll love it. But, um... Wait. So... This is Yawn. So Yawn is a big boy. He's, you can't, oh my God, you cannot see He's anything. so thick. He's got a lot of padding in his uh, belly and his hips. And his calves, and, Jesus yeah. Christ. He is a kaiju cat. Kaiju lucky cat. Look at his tail and his little coin spikes. <gasps> you guys. Look at him! Look at his tail! Look at him. I love the butt. I am interested in the thing. The thing? What thing? The belly? No. 
Also, yes, but no. What you're, okay, Taylor. I'm sorry, I'm in front. What are you trying to look for? Open it. Open it? Yeah. Why? I want to see if the padding comes out of the tail. So this is a padding pocket. It is, uh, I can't get the stuffing out. Excellent. Um, the tail is not, you can, you can take the stuffing out. Oh, hells yeah. It's, and it's got belt supports. It has belt supports in the tail and a pocket where you can take out the stuffing for like washing and stuff, I guess. Mm -hmm. That's going to be awesome. No, it's uh, the thighs and calves in the same way. Yes. It's hard to get in here. It's hard to get in here. Uh, yes, there are zippers in the, the thigh, the thigh. I imagine, yes, there are zippers as well in the calves. So all of the stuffing and padding is removable. And he's a big boy. He's a very big boy. And he's got, let me zip him back up. It's getting tired trying to, oh my God, this is gonna be hell. He's heavy. <laughs> he's heavy. I'm so pumped though, y'all. Too bad I live in fucking Texas. Or you'll die. Oh yeah, also, I said I was at a convention. I'm at Texas Furry Fiesta. You know. I'm struggling with the zip right now, honestly. There we go. So he features gold uh, quilted scale details on his belly, which I think Tunny did a fucking amazing job on, like, Oh my God. So you saw his body. We're gonna drape on the bed like a carcass. Ugh. You saw his feet paws and his hand paws. So really, that just leaves, he looks like a mountain behind me. He is a mountain. Oh my God. He is a meat mountain. So that just leaves the head. So I said who the character was, and my friend uh, who designed it, Candy Crave, I hope you're seeing this, and I hope you're as pumped about it as I am. Don't look at my shipping label, y'all. That would be rude. Let me just... But his cash app if you want feet pics. <laughs> No, don't, don't do that to me. Okay, I'm gonna set the box down. So my cash app if you want to see this. Oh, what is this? I can wake the computer up. <laughs> I, absolutely I not. So uh, this looks like a little, like a little mailer, like a custom mailer with like fursuit pictures from Tunny's suits. Goes with the custom tape. Yeah, they had custom tape on the boxes that had their logo and stuff. It's awesome, I might. Need to cut this open. Don't. Well, I was just gonna fold it over and show the custom tape. Okay, yeah. If you wanna show the custom tape, you can. It's really cool. It's Attention to just the little details, y'all. I've worked with Tony before. They've done a refurb for me in the past, and I will always recommend them. I will one hundred and thirty percent always recommend them for anything you need. They'll do refurbish refurbishments and all kinds of stuff like that. And the customer service is amazing. Absolutely freaking amazing. Aww. It's, it's, what is, I don't understand what this is. It's a magnet, probably. It's or, not. Or a keychain. It's like a little like button, but it's a keychain. Look at that. It's got like a little like, it's like, it's like a keychain though. Oh, I dropped it. Rip. Oh, I dropped it. So they use like a button press, but instead of putting a pin back on it, it has like a little charm hole that you put a, a key ring through. So that's really cool. I love it. I love it. Oh, I'm dropping stuff. This is a magnet. This is definitely a magnet. A magnet? Oh, I dropped that too. Got the drops, son. Got the drops, yo. Okay. <laughs> There's also a little envelope with a sticker on it. Oh dear, there's so much. There's a little sticker. Is this a, I guess this is a large vinyl sticker that has like business card information on the back. <coughs> look at that. So you can just look up, Tony says IDK on pretty much anything. 
and you'll find them. They have their own website. They have a bunch of uh, examples posted on there. They post a bunch on Twitter. So if you want to check them out, please, please do it. Oh my gosh. Oh, is this like, I love it when they give you care guides. Oh wow, that's a really well done care guide. I love it when they give you care guides. I'm not really gonna show y'all everything. Because it's a first week care guide. Because it's a first week care guide, but this super helps because I'm always super scared to like, like clean my fursuits because I don't want to ruin them. So it says a cleaning mixture guide, cleaning heads, brushing, uh, and no, specifically for yawn, be careful brushing against the gold. You don't want to do that. So this is, this is so freaking cool. How to add glasses. Like what? Like add fursuit glasses? N no, like how to put your glasses in and then put the head on. I've never seen that before. That's super what? helpful because, you know, I wear glasses. Oh, that fell over. I wear glasses. So that's super cool if they include, like, the best way to do that. So the attention to detail is amazing. I'm interested in that because I can't wear mine at all. Really? Not recently. There's so much goodies in here. What is this? Business cards? Oh, it's a whole, like, bushel of business cards, yo. You know? It's getting hot in here. Viral marketing. Yeah, it's set to 67 and that's as cold as it gets. And I will have these with me at the convention at TFF and I will give them out to anyone who wants one because like, I love Tunny. It's just awesome. They're amazing. I followed them for years. It's absolutely awesome. What is, what is this little dude? Sweet invoice. An invoice. You know, y'all don't need to see all that sh that that information. How much I hurt for this suit. How much I hurt for this suit. Oh, there's some more stickers. Some I like more. the card. I haven't gotten to the card yet. I'm sorry. I'm excited. I, oh man, I've been paying this suit off for literally a year. Some more little, little round stickies. Love it. Love that. And there's a little card and it's like a lucky cat. Like what? Like who goes out of their way to do that? And it just, it's all, it's like a little stand up dude. You can make him like a little standy. And it says, thank you. It just says, thank you. But that's so cute. That's so sweet. Just so sweet. Enough of that stuff though. Let's get into this. Just a bunch of paper. Oh. <laughs> oh my gosh. Come here, boy. Hold on, y'all. I'll get into that. We'll make sure there's nothing else in here. Okay. So this is the boy. Uh, he's currently suffocating, so we must save him from this predicament. Sealed with stickers. Sealed with stickers. They must spend a fortune on stickers. That's they just buy them in such bulk that they're like three cents each. Oh, it's two bags. It's two bags, and they're like tucked into each other. And stickered. And stickered. Bag. Sorry for loud rustling. I'm, I'm only a little sorry, this though. This is some ASMR stuff right here. Is this, is this, is this AS, ASMR? Is this ASMR? All right, D&D. <laughs> so, um, one thing I'll say is that the eyes that the suit currently has are not the eyes that he will be getting. That due to a time crunch and some other situational stuff, uh, Tony was not able to get the correct material for his actual eyes in time for me to debut at this convention, which I wanted to do because this year's theme is Kaiju and he is a Kaiju. So uh, we made an agreement that Tony would put in some temporary eyes. Uh, they still look amazing, but I will be sending the head back to get the permanent eyes after the convention. But uh, they were very nice. They made his collar, which I was not expecting at all. It has magnetic closures. Oh, that's nice. So it's really easy I to get. It was no, they're magnetic. So it's really easy to get on and off. Uh, I'll probably try to get a larger bell just for proportion's sake. But yes, I did not know that they were making the collar. So that was a very pleasant surprise when they emailed me about it. Um, there he is. Oh, I dropped him. There he is. There him go. There he is. Look at him. He's got his little gold coin on his head. He's got little chompers. He's got his whiskers. 
guys. We've got the continued gold detail. Yes, the gold on his neck and through his bodysuit. And he's lined. He's got the gold spikes on his back to line to his back, back of his neck. He is lined in red to match, you know, the theme. I'm trying to show you, and I'm just like... Struggling. I'm like so excited that I'm kind of shaking. Oh, wow. The lining on this fur, the stuff that's not red. Yeah, it's like a, it's like a, this whole part, you can't really see because it's white on white fur, but it's lined with like a, a sweat wicking or like a lycra or spandex material. And the inside of the head, the red part, which just looks kind of dark, in here is also that same material. Wait, do we want light inside to show? Oh, we can try, yeah. Oh God, I don't want notifications. Give me my flashlight. Oh God, what's happening? So he also has some vent holes in the top of his head uh, for his, where his ears uh, open up down here in his ear canal, I guess. Them ear vents. So love that. <laughs> love ear vents, like nobody's business. Can you wake up the computer? <laughs> okay. So yeah, you can kind of see it in there. It was kind of red. It's a very pretty like maroony sort of color. <laughs> Luxurious. Luxurious, and I don't know if you can see the vent holes. I'm trying to angle it. It's hard. Yeah, you can kind of see them. So that's awesome. I'm a, I love that. Uh, there's a cute little uh, IDK patch sewn into the back. A little applique. Love it. Love all of the, the tags and stuff. There was a tag in the bodysuit on the back of the neck as well. But look at him. His nose is so big and red, and I love it. Can you see Not a picky nose. No, it's embroidered. It's like a patch that was embroidered around just to make it like that detailing. Yep. He has like the little mouth line. He's got the teeth and he's got the tongue and it's awesome. Oh, his tongue is so poof. His tongue is so fat. He's squishy, I love it. But like, This like, is an embroidered tongue, not a silicone tongue. Yes, this is like a sewn, it's that, that same red um, lycra material. And it's just, oh, guys. You can't even see his eyes. I'm trying to show you. He's got his big old ears, his big oriental cat ears. What are they called? Oriental short hairs? Yes. Yes. That's him. That's what he is. The inside of his ears are red. I don't know if it's reading on camera. Uh, Lighting's not ideal. Yeah, our li lighting in a hotel room uh, turns out Sub not great. <laughs> Suboptimal. But, like, look at him. Oh my God. Guys. Guys, it's hell. I'm so happy. I can't wait to be him. I am him. Has the bit gone on long enough? I think the bit's gone on long enough. Sweet. <laughs> so really that that uh that about wraps up this unboxing. Uh I guess I could try to shoot a suit up video if maybe i don't know uh, i haven't had a full suit in like four years five years and longer since you've had one that you liked never since i've had one i liked so hopefully <laughs> <laughs> um so like i didn't have a chance to get the proper like uh, under uh, under armor material like to oh, wear fuck me. Uh, i do have like leggings that i'm gonna wear and stuff but guess what i forgot so don't <laughs> did you forget your under armor oh absolutely guess who's gonna be suiting in their underwear Oh my god. I'm going to suffer. That's disgusting. Yes, it is. It's don't, gross. Don't don't do what they do. Don't do that. Um but so if I I'll I'll try to do a, a suit up video. We'll see how it goes. If you don't see one, it didn't go well. <laughs> Honestly. Honestly, if you see one, it might have gone so disastrously badly that it's hilarious. That's also true. But like, because I love embarrassing my fiance. Like, it's a thing, though. But, like, guys, I'm going to be a big monster cat. Instead of the little gremlin that is the norm. <laughs> Calling you out on your own video. That's fine. I love you. I am a gremlin. We're just friends. We're just friends. It's fine. Uh <laughs> Shout out to Jen and Julian. Yo. But that's, that's really all I got to say. Uh, I got to go do stuff gotta unpack we haven't even unpacked we like walked in the hotel room went we, we walked in the hotel room dropped everything off went and registered picked up our badges and now we unbox this so we haven't even unpacked i don't even know if all my stuff is here like i know one of my suits is in here he's in the freaking car uh, <laughs> so
So we gotta go through, make sure everything's here, get everything set up, put our drinks in the fridge and stuff. You know, be people. Yeah. But, you know, thanks for watching. I really do appreciate it. Uh, if you did like the video, you can do the obligatory like, thumbs up, comment if you have any questions or anything about Tunny or the process of commissioning a suit. Or to, pick, to, to see uh, the designer of the character, the actual character. I will put those links in the description as well. I'll put a link to Tunny. I'll put a link to uh, Candy Crave uh, or Lemon Lottel. Whatever name you might know them by. Um, they did design Yon, so I'll definitely credit them for that. Um, That's what I'm thinking it is, right? I don't want to say their name in public, but they live in Florida. Yes. 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 Um, but what else am I going to put in the description? I'll put a link to my social media where you should be seeing pictures of, the, of this mad lad. Uh, so like my Twitter, probably my Instagram. We'll see. Whatever, just, whatever links are down there are going to be down there. So like you can check it out if you want. Uh, I don't have a SoundCloud to like rep or anything. So like that, don't have to worry about that. Uh, <laughs> so thank you so much for watching. I do appreciate uh, all of my viewers and subscribers and all that. I know it's been a hella long time since I posted a video. I haven't really done anything. I haven't been suiting or going to really that many fur meets. I do want to get back into doing that. So I said that, I say that every time though. So we'll see how it goes. If there's more videos, that's awesome. If there's not, uh, Ripperoni, and I'm sorry. We do have some more cons planned for this year. We do have some more cons planned for this year. I will definitely be going to Megaplex uh, with the Mad Lad. If you want to have a chance to see him, and you're going to be at Megaplex, you can totally check it out. Uh, so yeah, I don't know about any other cons we'll be going to, but if you're a Texas local, uh, I will be at AFM probably as in the remaining cooler months i don't know <laughs> about when it gets hotter you might die in the cooler months i might he's those thighs are gonna just kill me that's good oh i'm so excited but yes i said thank you, you. sweat <laughs> that's a medical condition <laughs> it's, i don't know it's either a good or a bad thing you might die so uh i said i've said thank you for watching like four times but actually i really do appreciate it i hope all of you have a nice day month year and life and i'll see you in the next video so Thank you. Bye.